today we're trying out <laughs> Lanethia's Lounge. Um, if you know, this is in Duluth, so it is close to me. It was like a 10 minute drive versus Versus, you know, all the other stuff it be. So, I did call and put my name on the list, but I don't even think that's the thing. But let's see. Okay, so the drinks were, I believe, $16 a piece. My friend had the rich bitch, and then I had the OG. Um, I was a little confused because they had big energy birthday celebration. So I don't know what that meant. But hey, the drinks are good. From talking to our waitress, we think that the menu changes every week, but they're still trying to settle on what is going to be the brunch menu i think this is only the second week of them doing brunch i was thinking about doing the braids oxtail and grits but she said oh they wasn't ready so that kind of bothered me but my friend ended up getting the shrimp and grits and i got the lobster and crab omelet so initially we thought that they were going to have bottomless mimosas but they did not so while we waited on our food i was like let's get a bottle of champagne and bring us some orange juice. And so we did enjoy some mimosas while we waited for our food, which did not take long to come. So here's our lovely waitress. She was really good hooking it up for us. Again, the food came out. Again, I had the lobster and crab omelet. She had some potatoes, the shrimp and grits, and we get into all of this later in the video. And then we asked for some salt and pepper. They had hot sauce, ketchup, all of it, y'all. And I know I probably sound tired, and it's because I'm recording this after brunch. And y'all, I'm hungover already. Apparently, it was so for Sunday, so they had my uncle up there giving us a rendition. Baby, my uncle was up there singing, but y'all, they got to read the room. It wasn't giving what it was supposed to give. Right, right now, I'm great. Hey. Oh, wow. <laughs> when I say this place is honestly a vibe, aside from the soulful uncle they came out and sung they were playing a playlist and baby we just got us a little hookah to keep the vibes going okay we kind of felt a little ways that we ordered a bottle and we didn't get the 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 fireworks and all that and we called her over she was like oh we knew them so that's how we did it we don't usually do it we kind of felt a little way, but whatever. Charges to the game. Um, we were taking a picture of the seating because the tables are really small. Like, this is more for, like, tapas, like how little the tables are. And the ladies had to, like, eat with the bowl in their hands. And that's just not rich bitch behavior. Come on, Auntie Nene. Welcome to La La Media. So I promise you, we was cute before we went in. This is terrible. Oh, sis, come on, man, get it together. <laughs> All right, guys. So I had to put my mask on because I'm looking tired as hell. All right, so Lanithia, the food was really good. My drinks were good. The service was good. The hookah was good. We didn't even finish it. Waste our money. It was like this much love. Dang, let's go back in. Okay, so <laughs> okay, so I had to take that to the back and finish. <laughs> they gonna give it to somebody else. All right, so I had the shrimp and grits with the hash brown on the side. So the hash browns came with 
the peppers in there so it was really mm -hmm. good i put a little hot sauce on there because that's just who i am um the shrimp and grits were good um i ain't had but like five shrimp <laughs> i wish i had had more shrimp but i had five but hey the 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 creole seasoning on top was really good um then i had the rich bitch <laughs> let me tell y'all about the rich bitch <laughs> drink in about 10 mm -hmm. minutes and it it's was dead. so good i was drunk as ah! i ain't gonna cuss um i was drunk y'all like i guess it was the force of rocks but it was really good then my girl out here what about a bottle, hey! this bottle. So you we, saw it in the footage so we were gonna do bottomless mimosas but they don't have bottomless yet so we just did a bottle. So my girl out here buying bottles. Baby, because we pop bottles. We popping them meaning checks, baby. In Duluth, baby. What's up? Hey. What's up? So we had the bottle. So we had about four. Most of the piece. Yeah, we had about like four piece. It to the rim. And we was filling it to the rim, y'all. The girl kept pointing for us because mm -hmm. if it was up to me, I wouldn't have. It but she just the little spray bottle. <laughs> but the girl kept pointing for us and she was pouring it, baby. First of all, y'all, the service wonderful Good. like they they like re a revolving door like everybody um, i think they had that five foot rule i remember when i was a server if you was in between five feet of a table you had to check on them and so they got that down pack i hope they keep that up because that was superb yes um and then your so we had the bottles and then after that i got a crown and spray a crown and apple and spray they have a full bar so then i got a crown apple and spray it was really good um i ain't gonna lie i'm hungry as hell now because the servings aren't huge but um maybe it could have been because i've been drinking and eating i mean drinking and smoking hookah so i'm gonna go eat again somewhere i don't know where um <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, um, but I'm about, definitely about to go eat again. But our service was great. Service 10 out of 10, like for real. Drinks 10 out of 10, for real. Food about an 8 out of 10. Ambiance is, I'm gonna give it a 10. Um, I ain't gonna lie now, y'all. Wait a minute. <laughs> You're not so, gonna do my uncle. You're not gonna do my uncle. What's my uncle name? Uh, I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Now, so at out. first they had just the playlist playing. But it's Soulful Sunday. So my guy came in there Baby, singing. On, oh, I took your car and my car. My, my guy. My guy. Emmanuel. He came, came in there singing, guys. My guy. He came in there singing. So he was singing Temptations. And then we just left because another duet came in. A man and a girl just came in. You got that car too? No. no. Oh, oh, another <laughs> duet. I got mad. I don't another, want this shit. Another duet came in there talking. I mean, singing. So we left. But like for real though, we're definitely coming back for Drink. um karaoke on Tuesdays. We gonna be here. We ready. Um, and then drinks for sure. I don't. Yeah. Oh, she had the lobster and cheese um <laughs> omelet. It was good. It was I tried good. it. And too. I had cheesy grits on the side. I did use what they need to do is put some of the Cajun sauce on the grits. I was trying to dip it out. Yeah, she was trying to get my Creole. I or had the OG drink. It was like a Hennessy martini. It was okay. It was just a, ma it said a mango margarita. <laughs> it was a margarita. It was a mango margarita, guys. No, but it was a Hennessy mango margarita. No, it's mar not. Yes, it was. No, it's not, sis. I'm going to run into y'all. I'm right. She wrong. She wrong. I'm going to show y'all the pictures. Um, And then I and had a Hennessy and cranberry, which was cheaper than the actual drink. So I probably, when I come back, I'm going to First of all, let me tell y'all, we spent the bag. Oh. Okay. I bought hookah and drinks and food. And we she bought bottles. a bottle, drinks and food. And we on, spent the bag. On top of the tip, we right. left another tip. We First of all, I ain't gonna lie to you. I ain't know the tip was in there. I ain't mean to though. Right. So I was like, I didn't know the tip was in there. Then I left her another 15. Bitch, damn. Then this bitch left another 20. I mean, ooh, not cuz. <laughs> this girl left another 20. If I had known that the tip was in there, I ain't gonna lie. I wouldn't have left the sis. I'm a I teacher. Up to like five more dollars. I'm a teacher. I wouldn't left nothing. Go ahead and um, buy me a coffee at the bottom. Go ahead and buy us a smoothie. You buy me one. We're going to give her one as well. Okay. Shout out to the young lady that followed me 
on YouTube. I'm getting her notifications right now. Networking up in here. You hear me? Like, use this as a place. And it's in Duluth. It's like 10 minutes from our house. Yeah, we stand, on, we stand on. She like 15. Too. But still, yeah. it's not in the city. So this is like the perfect spot yeah. for us people that stay in North Gwinnett. Like, yeah. North Atlanta. Um, yeah. When I called to make the reservation... I, I don't know who was on the phone. It sounded like Nene's husband, but he was real cool. He was like, oh, but you don't need a reservation. Which she got here first. Yeah. And she was just able to. I walked right in. They checked my purse. They told me they couldn't sit me until the whole party was here. And then she pulled right up. So that was really good. And this is really good because we're always driving about 35, 40 minutes to get to the city and go to brunch. And we love a brunch. We love to eat. We love to drink. So it's just like, so this is a really good, it's in a good spot. Like, I'm going to get home in about 10 minutes right now, guys. So, like, yeah, I'm going to jump on 316 and be there. And then what else? We said, okay, the seating was kind of weird. Oh, uh, yeah, y'all. I ain't going to lie. So She don't have full tables, guys. She have, like, the tapas. It's literally like a lounge. It, it is a lounge. If she had drinks and wings, we'll be good. Like finger food. Yeah. So like this, like our table, you'll see in the video, it's just like a little round table. And then they threw our our drinks, and then they had to sit our um our bottle right in front of us, which was weird. And then thankfully we waited until we got done eating to get our hookah because it took up the whole table. Yeah. Like no lie, you will see it in the video. Um, but. The table. Then you said you, her son came out and talked to you. Oh yeah, I just talked to her son. Um, I was going I to think the restaurant. His name is Bryce. I'm not sure. Whichever one is the the younger. owner. <laughs> Uh, whichever one is the owner. Um, I was going to the restroom. He was standing there. He had on a red, white, and blue USA shirt. He had the, two, the dreads with a hat. Um, if you see this, you know I saw you. Um, I was waiting for the restroom. He was like, "You're good," and I was like, "Yeah, just waiting on the restroom." He was like, "Okay." how was your you know who the like, how, how was it i was like oh everything was good you know but you know the personal the personable thing that's really good you know so he wasn't like in the back he was sitting right there with the two guys that had on all black he talked to me i went to the restroom i came out and he was still standing there drinking a the water or whatever so yeah i think i'm gonna give this place about an eight out of eight and a half out of ten this is probably one of the best vibes we've been to. Yeah, we eat all the time. I'm going to give it a nine. Okay. The, only, the only issue I had I was, was the tables. Mm -hmm. The only issue that I had was the tables. Um, I don't like that I was sitting up and my table was kind of down. And I had to reach over to eat. That ain't comfortable. You know what I'm saying? But, and then we were kind of like in a, like on a Community bench. Community bench. Like a bench. So it was like a couple next to us. And then it was us. And then it was another lady. And then, then they did seat four people. But they moved them. Um, and then so it was, you know, it just, and you know, it wasn't, you didn't have enough space, but that's the only reason that I was the food, drinks, hookah. Is just, that we're definitely gonna be back in like a week or two, like, yeah. we're definitely gonna be back. Yeah, we're definitely coming back for karaoke. Karaoke, um, they have a what is okay. that called? Um, not Jamaican Caribbean they have a Caribbean night we're gonna uh, and they have a cigar night as well right so, so we're like, gonna try to come back for all of those guys but I promise you like come have a good and time and they have valet who is that up in the, the G-Wagon though oh uh, they have valet parking guys we didn't do valet cause we were just like I could park myself we got here early but we're used to this this side of town yeah you know so. we're, we're from here so we're just like i go to juicy crab right here all right the time. The <laughs> so um uh, we just said we just you know parked ourselves but they have valet um yeah it's really nice come in and check it out definitely all right thank you cousins we love y'all bye if you come for us we're coming for you don't 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 even try it but we got time all the time it's gonna be summer Hang on, nothing but time. Nothing but time. I'm a teacher. I'm gonna come for you. Okay? For your neck. Bye. Bye, me at Starbucks.